And welcome back to another episode of Michigan High School Football at Home Challenge. I'm Casey Campbell. Thank you so much for joining us today. Of course, it is now time for another fun edition of the At Home Challenge. It's a game show. You get to answer questions. You get to see a lot of other people watch, answer questions and watch, and, and you can have fun too. So I'm going to ask our two participants to turn on their cameras um, right now. Okay, we have from Milford football, Victor Smith right next to me, and below is Ben Kolosi, also from Milford. How are you guys? What's up? I'm good. How are you? I'm, I'm good. doing good as well. All right, that's good, guys. Of course, um, we did a little test run yesterday, so you know how this game works. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, you know how this game works. Remember, round one, it is worth one point for, uh, for people that don't know or live under a rock. Um, so let's get this started. Victor, you're going to start us off in round number one. You're going to go first. Okay. All right. Okay. Who will the Detroit Tigers <laughs> open up the 2020 MLB season with in a few weeks? Is it A, the Chicago White Sox, B, the Cincinnati Reds, C, the Chicago Cubs, or D, the Minnesota Twins? What was A again? The White Sox. Mm. I'm, I'm going to go with A. Wrong. Dang. Ben, you know this one? Um, I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with C. You're wrong too. It was well. actually the Cincinnati Reds. Dang. What answer was that? We are still scoreless. Oh. All right, we're still scoreless. Okay, okay. All right, Ben, it is your question. Um, this name has been in the news a lot lately. Uh, what is Bubba Wallace's car number in the NASCAR Cup Series? Is it A18, B1, C43, or D4? I'm going 43. You would be correct. Of course, you drive the go. 43 car Chevrolet no. with the Petty Motorsports. Ben. Um, ben is up one to nothing. But, Victor, you can get back in this. Um, mm -hmm. All right. The Dallas Cowboys have recently hired a new head coach for the 2020 season. Who just might that be? Is it A, Jim Caldwell, B, Mike McCarthy, C, Jason Garrett, or C, Will Muschamp? What was option B? Mike McCarthy. I'm going to go with B. You'd be right. It is there B. You McCarthy. There you go. There you go. Cowboys hired the former Packers head coach to replace the fired Jason Garrett. Um, so Victor and Ben are now tied at one of these. Mm -hmm. Oh, we tied. We tied. All right. All right, Ben. You're, this is your next question. For the first time ever, um, of course, the NASCAR All-Star Race is this weekend. Of course, NASCAR mm -hmm. has a few sports currently back right now, but that's going to change in a few weeks. For the first time ever, NASCAR, the All-Star Race will be held at what track on Wednesday night? Is it A, Charlotte Motor Speedway, B, Bristol Motor Speedway, C, Darlington Raceway, or D, Daytona? C. Wrong. You know, oh. I'm going to go with B. You, sir, would be right. It is Victor. There you go. There you go. Victor takes what? a 2-1 lead. Yep. And it's actually your question. So uh, Ooh. You, can get, you can get yourself a two-point advantage on Ben. There you go. All right. All right. What, is the, what was the first leg of the Triple Crown this year in 2020? Remember, we, they had to change it all because of the pandemic. Mm -hmm. Was it A, the Kentucky Derby, B, the Preakness, C, the Belmont Stakes, or D, the Breeders' Cup? I'm not sure about this one, but I'm, I'm going to go with D. No. Oh, dang. You know one? Say, tell me B again. What's B? B was the Preakness. And what's A? Uh, uh, the Kentucky Derby. Is it B? Is B the one you're going to go with? Yeah, I'm going with B. Uh, it is not. It, it, it was the Belmont Stakes. 
So victory still have a still has a two one lead over you, Ben. We're good. Um, but Ben, this is your question. Mm -hmm. Of course, Michigan has not seen a lot of sports back since because of the pandemic. But one did come back a, a couple weeks ago. What was the first major sporting event to come back to the state of Michigan since the COVID nineteen pandemic? Was it A, the Rocket Mortgage Classic, B, NASCAR at MIS, C, the Detroit Grand Prix, or D, Detroit Tigers Baseball? Ooh. Is it C? It is not C. Uh, Victor, you know this one, bud? I'm going to go with B. That is coming back, but it is wrong. It was the Rocket Mortgage <laughs> Classic last week at, at the Detroit Golf Club. But NASCAR will be back at MIS next month but okay so it's victor still leads ben two to one as we enter into round two remember questions are worth two points so yeah i'll be straight i got this and uh since victor victor i think you went first last round so ben yes. gets to mm -hmm. go first in this round all right ben all righty who has the most passing yards in NFL history? Was it A, Tom Brady, B, Peyton Manning, C, Brett Favre, or D, Drew Brees? Ooh, this is a good one. This is a good one. This is a good one. I'm second between two, two. Yeah. So you said D is Drew Brees? Yes. And B is Peyton Manning? Correct. And then what's C? Brett Favre. Not Brett Favre. Um, I don't think it's Tom either. I'll go with no. I'm gonna go with B. No, it's not Peyton. Do you know this one? Uh, I'm gonna go with D. You would be right. Yeah, there you go. I knew, yeah. yeah, I knew it was. Because I knew I rem it was yeah, I remember because they broke was, the record last year. It was. I thought Peyton Manning broke it too. He did. Uh, the, he well, he had the touchdown record just a few years ago. He had the touchdown record. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think. I didn't know what record he had. I knew he had a record. I didn't know which one. The good news is that's not a question. I don't think. All right. Sense. Cool. All right, but Victor does lead Ben. There you go. To one, Ben, you have some catching up to do. Yeah, I do have some. <laughs> we'll be fine. We'll be fine. In what year did the Cleveland Browns return to the NFL leaving after leaving in the 1995 season? Was it A, 2005, B, 1999, C, 1997, or D, 2001? Mm. What, what was C? 1997. I'm I'm gonna go with I'm gonna go with C. You're going with C? Yeah. You'd be wrong. Dang. All right, Ben. This is a, this is a time to get back in this thing. All right. So what's A? So 2005 is A. And what's B? 1999. B. Yes, it is B. Oh, dude, I was, I was two. I was two years old. Victor, so Victor, you still lead 4-3, but Ben is right on your tail in this mm -hmm. oh, Come back, Caesar. Upset City. Which, which of these teams have never won the Super Bowl? Oh. Is it A, the Denver Broncos, B, the Minnesota Vikings, C, the Green Bay Packers, or D, the New Orleans Saints, who has not won the Super Bowl out of those four? Is this my question? Yes. Man, you give me ones I swear I know, and then it's just like, I don't know. Um, all right, so the Saints. Uh, what's B? The Vikings. Vikings. And then what's C? The Packers. Has Aaron won a Super Bowl? I don't know. And then Broncos have. I'm gonna go with no. I'm gonna go with B. Well, it's a good thing you did go with B because you're right. Let's go. Oh, yes, crap. Aaron Rodgers did win a Super Bowl back in 2010. Yeah, um, yeah I was trying to remember uh, that. So, 
So goodness gracious, what would the, what would the, so the, so the score was Ben has now leads five to four over Victor, but. Let's go. I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back. Okay. Uh, who was the leading rusher for the 2004 Detroit Lions? Oh. Was it A, Kevin Jones, B, Kevin Smith, C, Javid Best, or D, Joey Harrington? I can tell you it's not D. Hmm. Can you re-read re the options again? Uh, Kevin Jones, A, B, Kevin Smith, C, Javid Best, or D, Joey Harrington? I'm going to go with B. No. Can no. you this one? And did you say it can't be D? Is that what you told me? Well, it would not be D. I just threw that in there just for fun. All right, all right. So, all right. So that I, I, so that it could be D. Well, it could be, but it's not. Okay, it's not D. All right, what's what? All right, how do you get two? You know, I used to. You know, answers, when I was man. little, I wore when I was little, I wore a Javi Best jersey. So I don't, I don't know if that would. What's A? A is Kevin Jones. Ooh. Kevin Jones. That sounds, that sounds oh, familiar. Yeah. I don't know how long best was. A. Going A. You'd be right. Let's go. Dang. Let's go. So now it's 7 4, I think. Yes. Let's go. That's a comeback right there. Ben, this is your question. <laughs> All right, Ben. Who is which is the who is the official pizza of the NFL? Is it A Papa John's, B Little Caesars, C Pizza Hut, or D none of the above? Let me think about this one. Um, so what's D? You said what was D? None of the above. D is Ooh. none of the above. Okay. And then so you said Little Caesars, Pizza Hut, and then what was the other one? Papa John's. Is it, is it Papa John's? No. Ooh. Mm, I'm, I'm going to go with D. You're wrong, too. No, wait. It's oh, I was wrong. It was Papa it's John's. Pizza. Yeah, That's what I thought. Papa yeah. John. But they changed, I think, a few years ago to Pizza Hut after Papa, after, after Papa John left Papa John's. So. Dang. But the good news, I'm, Ben, you still lead seven to four, and Victor, you can still catch up because now in round three, questions are worth three points. And mm -hmm. guess who gets to start off round number three? That's me, you, Victor. There you go. Okay, I did the more. I did so. I did another one of those these sports grab bags, and they're they're pretty fun. Let's get a local connection in here. Why don't we? Uh, when right. was the last time the Heartland Eagles beat the Brighton Bulldogs in football? Ooh. Was it A, 2004, B, 2008, C, 2015, or D, 2019? What was C? 2015. I'm going to go with C. You'd be right. There you go. It was 2015. Yeah. Um, so now – it is a tie game. It's all tied up. It is all tied up. Ben, it is, this is your question, bud. All right, Ooh. sweet. The Detroit Lions have had one playoff win in the last 50-plus years. Which team did they beat? Would it be A, oh, the really Bears, B, the Green Bay Packers, C, the Dallas Cowboys, or D, the Atlanta Falcons? Last fifty years. I I do remember a game. I don't think it's Dallas because I remember a game where where Dallas where the referees were horrible and we lost to Dallas in the playoffs. So I'm not gonna say it's Dallas. So there's Atlanta. You said Atlanta, Green Bay, and Chicago Bears. Yeah. Green Bay's a rival, and I feel like I'd really know if we beat a rival in the playoffs. So I'm not gonna say Green Bay, Chicago, or Atlanta. That's what I'm going with. I'm going with Chicago. Wait, no. You sure? No, I'm going Chicago. Okay, you'd be wrong, though. 
Oh. You're gonna kick yourself when you hear the answer, but I'm gonna give Victor a chance. Mm, I'm gonna go with Green Bay. You're wrong too. Then oh. you, you second guessed yourself because it was Dallas back in it 1991. Was. It was that, Dallas. That was their only play. Uh, man, I just remember. I remember a couple years back we lost. Yeah, the, to Dallas yeah, in the, the 2014 game. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, but they did beat Dallas back in. Uh, Back in 1991, that was when they had Troy Aikman and Emmett Smith and all that. Really? That was, yeah, that was kind of their, like, coming out party. And they actually made it to the mm-hmm. NFC Championship game, but they lost to the eventual Super Bowl champion. That would, uh, that would of course, be the team that changed their name today. Mm-hmm. So, the Redskins. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, so after that, Victor, this is your question. The Olympics are postponed for 2020 because of the COVID-19 pandemic. And won't compete again until next year, 2021. It's been delayed. What country will it be in? Is it A, China, B, Japan, C, Germany, or D, Canada? Hmm. What what was C? Germany. I'm going to go with C. No. This is Japan. Yeah. It's, it's, Japan. it's Japan? It's Japan? It's Japan. It's Japan. It's back his lead. It is Let's now to seven. Mm. I remembered it was Japan. I didn't know it would be Japan. Yeah. Well, the good news is, Victor, you can get this lead back. Okay. You have the next question. Who led Major League Baseball in home runs – Last season, would it be oh. A, Jorge Soler, B, A, Eugenio Suarez, C, Pete Alonso, or D, Cody Bellinger? Cody Bellinger kind of seems familiar. What, what, what was B? B was A, Eugenio Suarez. Mm. Mm, I'm, I'm going to go with D. You're going with D? Um, yeah, I'm going with D. I'm going with D. Wrong. All right, I guys. probably second guess myself. All right, so I can really think, reread the question. Can you do that? Who led Major League Baseball in home runs in 2019? Was it A, Jorge Soler, B, A, Eugenio Suarez, C, Pete Alonso, or D, Cody Bellinger? Of course, D was already said, and it was mm. wrong. All right, what's B? B was A Eugenio Suarez. Going no. What's A? Oh my goodness. Jorge Soler. Jeez. I'm going B. I'm going B. Wrong. Yeah, I'm guessing it's A. It was C. Oh, it was C? It was Pete Alonso from the Mets. He had 53 home runs last year. God really? damn. damn. But the good news is, Ben, you still have a 10 7 lead, and it is your question. And you can right, pull so away and maybe even clinch. All right, let's go. We got this. All right. Who won the very first Super Bowl in 1967? Nice. Was it A, the Kansas City Chiefs, B, the Green Bay Packers, C, the Dallas Cowboys, or D, the Oakland Raiders? Ooh. And this is the very first Super Bowl. Yes, this was the very first Super Bowl. I swear I've looked this up before because I was curious. Um, there's no way it's the Raiders. Um, so you said you said Green Bay, um, Kansas City, and then what was the other one? Dallas. Dallas? I'm, all right, I'm eliminating Dallas. I'm going to eliminate the Raiders. Green Bay or Kansas? I'm going Kansas City. No. Keeps up. No. All right. Victor? Uh, I'm going to go with. Hmm. What, what was C? C was the Cowboys. I'm going to go with C. Wrong. I'm guessing it's Kansas. It was the Packers. It was the Packers? 
Yeah. yeah. Vince Lombardi and the Packers won actually the very first two Super Bowls. Ooh, there you go. Yeah. I didn't know that, though. So it is 10 to 7. And it is your question, Victor. And you can tie. And then we get to go to a tiebreaker. There you go. Okay, so Victor, this is your question. Ben still did 10 7. If it's wrong, Ben wins. Okay, okay. Ooh, ooh, okay, I gotta take my time on this one. What when was the last time the Los Angeles Lakers won an NBA championship? Was it A, 1999, B, 2001, C, 2009, or D, 2010? What was B? 2001. Mm. I really got to take my time on this. Two. Don't look it up, man. No, was there? I'm, I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with, was B 2001? Yes. I'm going to go, I'm going to go with B. Wrong. Oh crap. Ben, you can you can get this one. It's C or D. I know for a fact it's, it's nine or ten. Um I'm trying to think of the year. Was it D? It was twenty ten. Oh, crap. It was D. Yeah. So Ben is your winner. Third Let's go. to Let's seven. Go. Let's go. My goodness, how do you feel about this one? You know, hey, I feel good. I feel, I feel good. horrible. You know, comeback city, upset city. This is what we do. <laughs> you need okay, to think Victor needs redemption. Yeah, I need redemption. We'll have to do this again sometime. Oh, yeah. We'll have a part two. We'll have a part two. Yeah, we can do a part two. We'll have to. Oh, yeah. Um, we can do a part two later. So. And did redeem himself today. Yeah. yeah. Hey, by the way, thank you both for doing this. Um, really no problem. Hey, no problem. This is going to be out later on, later on today or this week or whenever I get time to it. Thank you both for coming on. Um, yep. Thanks for doing this, and hope you guys get a season. All right. Thank you. All right. Yep. Uh, I'm Casey Campbell. We'll see you next time on the High School Football at Home Challenge.